Patrick from Williamsburg Blue Pirate Games Galore here and welcome back to another video and welcome to a very special video. So your viewers know that today is Veterans Day, the day where we celebrate all of our men and women that served in our armed forces for freedom in this great country and this video will be together with the parade that I'll be recording later today. That'll be happening at 6.30. I should have this special video up by sometime this evening. Stay tuned. So for this video, I just want to talk about, you know, what today represents and just want to thank a couple of veterans that I know of. If I know, if I don't know any veterans, except the ones that I do know, I'm not going to, I don't need to apologize. So anyways, let's get to it. So Veterans Day is very special to plenty of people that live in this great country. You know, we celebrate all of our veterans that served in all of the armed forces and made the ultimate sacrifice for freedom in this country. And I just want to talk about a couple people from my family that that served. Now, I know there's a bunch of people here in Williamsburg that are veterans. I don't know many of them, so if I miss anybody... No, it's no problem. So, I just want to start with my dad. Uh, for those who don't know, he served in the Air Force. And he did a lot of traveling while in the military. He went to places like Alaska and Germany and Texas. And he did a lot of traveling while he was in the military. I worked on this. So, let me mention this too. We had a project that we did back in ninth grade when I was still in high school. We did this oral history project, and we were to interview somebody in our family, ask them all these questions, interview them, and, and then put a paper together and type it. So I did this particular oral history project on my dad. I interviewed him, and I put, the, put it all together. And if viewers know, during COVID, we were not able to present it, but I do have it somewhere. I don't know where it is. I'm not going to worry about, you know, digging to try to find it. But it was just so cool to be able to interview my dad and have him talk to me about all these, you know, things he was able to do while in the military, all the places he went to. Like I said, he went to. Germany and Alaska and Texas and he was in just about every single place when he was in the military so like I said my dad served in the Air Force so I want to give a big shout out to him thank you for your service dad and then I'll also next I'll talk about a guy that you viewers probably do not know so these next two people they go to our church uh, I'm going to start with Palmer Brown. So I don't know what particular military he served, which branch, but he served. So I want to give a shout out to Palmer Brown, member of our church family. And then Dave Greaser also served in the military. He told me a lot of military stories that I do not remember. I apologize for that. But he did serve in the military, so... Dave Grizzard, thank you for your service. And then I learned this yesterday. I was going through Facebook and I saw that Megan Palmer had shared a post on Facebook from some other person. And it had a picture of Jerry Palmer whenever he served in the military. So that's how I found out that Jerry Palmer, our varsity baseball head coach and our bus driver, that's how I knew that he served in the military. Now, I do not know what branch that he served, but I just want to take a moment and just, just say to Jerry Palmer, thank you for your service to this great country. So I want to thank all of those that I mentioned in this part of the video, my dad, Palmer Brown, Dave Greaser, and Jerry Palmer, and anybody else that I might have missed. I just want to take a moment and just say all those that I just mentioned and those that I didn't mention. Thank you for your service and your sacrifice to this great country. 
Without you, we would not be living in a free country. We would not have the freedoms that we have today without the sacrifices that you that you people made. I just want to thank everybody, not only here in Pennsylvania, but all around the United States. I just want to say thank you, whoever you are, thank you for your service to this great country. And now I'm going to throw it over to our Veterans Day Parade that is happening on High Street in Williamsburg. Thank you. 